Hello and welcome to another GTA 5 online video. On today's episode we're going to be looking at this new revolver that you can get. Uh, I'd also like to mention, uh, just to say Merry Christmas to everybody. Hope you've had a great uh, Christmas and uh, hope you have a good new year. So you, you're going to be in a random session and then all of a sudden you're going to get this email pop up. It's going to show you a picture and there's various different locations and stuff like that. But obviously this one is of a bridge, it looks to be. So um, when you, after you've looked at the video, it's gonna, after you've looked at the picture, it's gonna show you the roundabout location on the map, as I'm showing you here. Uh, it's gonna be marked with a, it's gonna be a radius. Within this radius is where the, uh, the secret or the the clue is going to be, and there's also gonna be a question mark to uh, help you locate this on the map. Okay, so I came to the location. Uh, it seems to be in the snowy valleys of Mount Chiliad, and uh, I think if you look to the right, uh, there you go, you can see the bridge. So I was looking around for ages, and uh, you start to hear Christmas bells ringing, uh, little bells ringing. So if you listen carefully, now uh, you can hear them, and basically you have to follow this, these bells until uh, they get louder and louder and louder and uh, you will find the first clue as you can see I was being a bit uh... well I didn't know what I was doing really so I'm looking around I can hear the bell I'm like nope it's quieter here I need to be careful because I'm on the edge of the cliff and it's very slippy but then I noticed I was like oh look at that boulder it looks a bit uh... Is there something on it? So I walk round and BOOM! Piece of paper. And there you go. Gives you a bit of a clue. And apparently these people have moved the treasure and that we'll never find it. And then like a Red Dead Redemption kind of uh, story mission kind of thing pops up. As you can see there's three markers on the map. So uh, we're going to check this one out first. Because this is the definitely the hardest one to find, which I uh, discovered on doing this treasure hunt. I do recommend using a helicopter for these uh, finding these clues because they're scattered. Of, there's three of them, but they are scattered quite like around the map and stuff like that. So I land it like a pro. So I just decided to bail. And I brought the helicopter. Which is a bit annoying. So this one's very tricky to find if you don't know where you're looking. So I ran so you run around here and uh, as you can see there's uh, something in the corner of that cliff. Would you look at that? There's a cave. And it seems to be someone who's had their head beaten in. And that is the first clue discovered. Very Christmassy, somebody had been murdered. But uh there you go. So we found clue one of three. So we're going to be looking for the other clues now. So you're going to basically repeat this, go to the area on the map, and uh, it should show you. Uh, sorry, it'll give you a, a little area on the map, and that is what you're going to use to uh, look for the clues. But that is by far the hardest one, because it's in a little cave, and you want to know that it was there. So here we go, the second clue. Here we are. So here we go, we're going to climb up this little bit of a cliff. And uh, there's like an abandoned fishing house or something. And again you can hear the bells ringing. And what's that? Looks to be a weapon. So I'm guessing that was what was used to uh, beat our old friend up. So we found two of three. So there is only one more clue to find. And then the gun is ours. And as you can see, I've gone from a very professional looking helicopter to some random car I stole. 
so yeah. Okay, the final one, this is by far the easiest one to find, but it's kind of hiding in plain sight, so maybe people will struggle with this, I'm not sure. But you run over to this tree, and then bam! What, what, what would you look at that? No gun. I've been swindled. But somehow we have gained access to the location of the chest by finding these three clues. I don't know how, but. There you go, so we're gonna travel to the actual location of the treasure, which happens to be the gun. Obviously very Red Dead Redemption themed as Red Dead Redemption 2 will be coming out soon. Very excited for that. But as you can do, I just jump off edge of a cliff. And uh, here we are, the treasure. And then look, two people have killed themselves over it, it's not good. There we go. And I do have to say that this gun is very good and if you get 50 headshots you get 250 grand and uh, yeah it's pretty good. So I'm going to wrap this video up now. I hope you all have a good New Year's and uh, we'll be seeing you in 2018 for more gaming content please like subscribe and we'll catch you next time peace